Tomorrow, October 28th, one of the most interesting projects that has graced Dublin city centre in the last months, the Barricade Inn, is going to be dragged into the High Court. An injunction is being sought to try and force the Barricade to move out of the building they have occupied for the last months, a building that was allowed to, to lie vacant for about 13 years and falling into a state of decay. Will the courts decide in favour of a group of people with no real funds who brought this building back into use and turned it into a hub of activity, or will they decide in favour of a legal firm? The answer to that question will tell you a lot about the society you find yourself in. A society where on the one hand there are thousands of homeless people and people sleeping on couches, and on the other hand, there is something in the region of 300,000 empty homes that could be used to house those people. As we have reported previously here on Solidarity Times, this summer has seen the occupation and eviction of multiple buildings in Dublin 7. Almost none of the buildings that people have been evicted from have been brought back into use. Instead, they've been allowed to lie derelict as pieces on a monopoly board for property developers. This has to stop.